What's going on, people? I just got back from work, and of course, I come home to a bounty. Marvel finally dropped the Captain Marvel trailer, and uh, I've always wanted to try my hand at trailer reactions. So, uh, we'll see how this goes. I have not seen it, this trailer yet. I, It has been killing me, sitting at work for four hours going like... <laughs> so, now we are not going to lay any further, so, you know what, uh, let's just get to it. And, and she fought... Uh, why do Marvel movies always start with falling? A blockbuster! No! Ah! Whenever blockbusters get hurt, I die and little inside. Wait a minute, that organization of the shelves, that's that's no good. That's no good. I know a renegade soldier when I see one. Never occurred to me that one might come from above. Oh, you're so young, Nick. Wait a minute, will it be 10 years next year? So this is early 90s, so does this mean Nick Fury has a wallet that says bad motherfucker? Maybe, possibly. All right, this this fighter pilot angle does not work unless they're playing Danger Zone. But I can't tell if it's real. Oh, what do we got? We get Jude Law. We have no idea what threats are out there. Ah, we got. The oh, she just punched an old lady. I'm sure there's some actual context when we actually watch that, but in the end, the old lady just got punched. Yeah, probably, probably said make America. Mm. I'm not what you think I am. Oh, that's Alex Jones. Oh, that's Alex Jones. Oh, I love that. I love the take on the outfit. Mm. And we just saw Coulson. This is Coulson with a bit more hair than usual. Teaser trailer, of course. So uh, they don't give us anything more than that. But I, I'm good. I've got no cons to it, really. I mean, at this, I, you know, I think we, it's come to the point now where Marvel has done so well consistently that we're just waiting for that time when, we, when they find that one that kind of trips them up. I, there's a part of me not thinking it's going to be this one. I don't, actually, I don't want it to be this one because given the fact that this is going to be their first female-led, strictly female-led movie, um, this one... I think, first off, I definitely am op optimistic this is going to do well. I think Brie Larson, Brie Larson is, she's got the presence in the role. Um, didn't really, she didn't say much in it, so it's still early to tell how her performance is going to be. But she's already got the presence in the role, which is great. Um, I'm sorry, my heart is still aching over that Blockbuster. Oh, God. I, I'm sorry. I used to work at Blockbuster, so anytime I see one hurt. There was a little part of me that died inside when all of them started closing down. Damn you people, you were what? Stop whining about your late fees. If you don't want late fees, get them back on time. Ah. Uh, so, at this stage, uh, it looks it looks par excellence for the Marvel Cinematic Universe. So, I am I am delighted. I'm optimistic. Um, as far as I can tell, the de-aging on Samuel Jackson looks pretty good. It's going to have to look good considering he's playing a pretty substantial role in this one. So we have, uh, we can only, so time really can tell. So uh, I guess while I got you, uh, we're going to be kind of uh, taking a break for a while. Uh, I will have another episode of Cinema Schlock coming up pretty soon. And um, then we also have the, then we have uh, Rare Delicacies with all of our uh, Halloween offerings uh, coming up once per week. And then on Halloween Day, we'll have a new uh, Halloween edition of the Cinema Schlock Society, all leading into Double November. So keep your eye. We got a whole bunch of stuff coming up your way. And uh, see ya.